Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft Let's Play series. I've done some prep, I've done some things, there's this, there's that, the sun is going down, let's sleep. Um, so, I realised I need resources. Uh, and I, I found out something. If you use a fortune pick, right, on other things that you wouldn't expect to use a fortune pick on, it works. Like, fortune works on iron ore now. So we're going to tear down this whole thing, because we need all these resources. It's gold, iron, coal, diamonds, redstone, there's some lapis in there somewhere. I think it's on this side. Uh, can't see it. It's deep in there. But um, we're just going to quickly mine through all of this. So let me maybe speed this up, because this may take a second. thought I'd leave the diamonds for last. So we've got what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 16 diamonds here. Oh, 16 plus another 6. So that is maths. 16 plus 6 is 22? Yes. <laughs> there we go. So, with all of that gone, let's take inventory of what we got. Oh, look at that. So we got, what is that? One, two, three and a bit stacks of coal, a stack and a bit of iron, a stack of got. Look at the diamonds, though. We got a lot of diamonds. Let's get to that. Um, lapis, we got stack and a bit of. Uh, we got a lot of redstone, obviously. You get a lot always. Diamonds, a huge amount. No, and then look at this. Perfect. One of the reasons we needed all of this is because actually we're running quite low on stuff. Like, we've not got a huge amount of stuff. We need to start smelting uh, some of this stuff down. So let's actually just, for the sake of it for now, um, let's just do that, that, and then that, just because we've got the coal just to... Chuck it out there a little bit. Um, chuck that in there. Because um, what we need is once once a couple more's gone. Uh, so we've got the diamonds here. We've got a stack and a bit of diamonds, you know. We're not doing too bad. Uh, blocks. Let's blockify some of this because it is going to take up a lot of inventory otherwise. Uh, lapis blocks as well. Just to get some of this a bit more dense. Uh, one of the reasons we needed more resources is because I've been prepping boxes. So I've prepped a box for the iron farm stuff, which this one wasn't as intensive to be fair. Like, that's 15 iron. That's it, realistically. But this box took a lot of stuff. That's 40 iron, plus then 25 iron, plus then like 6, 7, 8, 5, like... 10 iron, plus then the observers and the redstone, like, this drained us a little bit, and this is for a melon and pumpkin farm, an automated one, because I'm a little tired of um, manually harvesting these, and I feel like I could probably get better rates, and I do a lot of trading with melon and pumpkins to my farmer, so I'd like to have it a bit more efficient and a bit more um, 
cost effective. So, we actually have it set up either to do the iron farm today or to do the melon farm. And I'm thinking the iron farm might be what we go with first because it just seems a bit more reasonable to go with the iron farm. Um, it's going to require a little bit more work as well. That's why I also made some more of this so that we'll have some more blocks. Um, let's just make sure we take out a little bit of all of this so that it's at least out. There we go. Because uh, this one would have overflowed and it wouldn't have finished cooking. The other two were just for fun. I also tamed another cat. They seem to all go into the nether for some reason, which is pretty confusing. Um, but we need, so we now have two cats. But we need, yeah, we need the iron farm because we need the iron for beacons and various other projects. So, um, yes, we need to do that. <laughs> Let's just uh, do this and do this. And we'll go and trade these. Because they trade quite decently. It's not the worst. What we're going to need to do, there should probably be a new baby down here. Um, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, no baby yet. Um, but we can trade with this guy. Like, it's not bad trades. The six for one isn't the greatest. But the four for one isn't bad. Um, so what we're going to need to do at some point is bring four of them up there and then um, get it all sorted, basically. For now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little bit of a jump cut because I'm going to re-watch the video because there's a video of how to do it. I want to re-watch it um, because I don't trust myself in um, actually being able to do it. Uh, so we're going to... What the plan is, I think is the reason I want to do this one now is because I don't want to build up too much of a villager infrastructure down here. So we're going to move... There's a couple blank villagers, the ones that don't have any rolls down there right now. We'll move them up into the villager breeder, which will produce the iron. There'll be a lava blade here, done. Um, and then what I'll do at the same time is I'll move the, the, the villagers that we're keeping over to the temple because there's an easy way in now. And then we'll be a bit more tidier over here. Then what we're going to do is we're probably going to clear this area up a little bit to put the um, automated pumpkin farm. We might even put it like here. Just I need this space gone. Um, and just get it all done really. I think we're making some good progress. Why is that dolphin just sat there? Um, yeah, so I'm going to go and watch the video now. I'm going to try and relearn what I'm doing and then see how we can progress. Okay, so I'll be back in just a second. Okay, hello and welcome back to my Let's Play series. Now, I know the last time, uh, well, not even that. I don't know why I've reintroduced it. That's how you know it's been a while. And when I say a while, it's been a day. And the last thing I said I would do is I said, oh, I'll go away, I'll look at the tutorial. And then from the tutorial, we will um, then progress and make the iron farm. Well, uh, it's been a day and this is here now. Let me just explain what this is. So it's a little shoot as we had last time. We had this last time. Then there's a nine by nine platform with four beds in and a little like bubble column in the middle. Cause I think somebody said soul sand is needed for this to work a bit better. Um, I don't know. And then you come up here and then there's this, and this is all like the holes where each villager will go down, basically. So currently, we're going to try and do one villager at a time. I thought I'd definitely show this part off. Uh, we've got a huge bubble ele elevator here. So we just need to try and get the villagers now. Um, whoop, don't fall. Um, so without further ado, we're going to need to go... I'm going to use these blocks, I think, because we're going to need to make this a... Uh, a two by two to get at least a boat through. Or well, we could do, we could do something that would be a bit easier, which would be a. Um, damn, we've got no way out now, except up through here, all the way to here, this way. <laughs> jump, jump, done. Okay, 
Uh, we could actually use the minecart that we have here and the rails. There's a zombie somewhere and it's very concerning to me. Um, well, we can't use this obviously, but we can definitely make another minecart and just use the rails really quickly to catch them one at a time. Um, just because I feel like this is going to be the easiest way to extract them. Also at night is going to be a bit easier because I can just break the individual beds I need to break rather than them all getting a bit rowdy. And then I can just come here and I can just go like, oh, so that's going to be a bit of an issue. If I break this, right, that's going to happen. But then I put this here. Beautiful. That's all I needed to know. Yeah, that zombie's going to really trigger me a little bit. Okay. Who's first? This guy and then this guy. Okay, so let's just do that and then let's... Wait, where's he? Oh. Damn it. That's not what we wanted. Don't come back. We need you to be somewhere like here-ish. And then I break you. And then you go into the minecart. There we go. And that's you now going this way. We break this. This is pure genius. And then push you in and up. And then you go all the way up. There's only one way out, my friend, which is onto this. Come on, out. 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 You are out, okay. And then we just need you to go the direction you need to go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Beautiful. And I think he even claimed the bed. Can I see? He did claim the bed. Perfect. So then we just have to repeat that. Hup. Beautiful. Aqua just diving like a pro. Uh, so then we come down here. We've got the minecart. Beautiful again. We break this. We put this down. We've got to come and get the other one before he wakes up. Let's just do like this. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Get in the minecart, though. Get in the minecart. You've got no job, so I'm not uber worried about you, obviously. I don't know what that banging is. Someone's just banging away in my flat. I don't know if you guys can hear that. I'm sorry if you can. I don't. I don't live here properly. It's a. It's a room share, and the peeps are here. Okay, right, so this is this is plan two, and we've got to come in and we break this one here. And hopefully he registers the bed. Oh, we've got another bed on us, shit. Yeah, okay, now to the bed. Come on. Come on. Yeah, okay, so which bed are you going to? The only one you have path of sight for. And you're in bed. Beautiful. That is two done. Uh, I can just check this. That's fine. So that's the first two done. Uh, one and two. So we just now need to do um, the next two. Which one will go here. And then one will go there. Uh, we do need them to breed though down there. So what we've got to do is we've got to go back down. Place some of these beds again. So we come back down break this for a second uh, and we've got to place some of these beds again and then I mean we may as well well we need the wheat I made some wheat in a, in prep for this because I was like oh I know they're gonna need wheat to um, just to make babbies so we then come down here Did I put it in there no probably put it in the food chest then out of here uh, yeah, I did. So we're going to go and drop all of this for them. And then hopefully that'll make two new villagers who then I can take up there in the same process pretty much, have them claim the beds, and then that will be everything we need basically sorted to make this happen. So 
We'll come and we'll sleep, just to get everyone to wake up. That baby zombie's very worrying. He's somewhere. Then what we're going to do is we're going to chuck all of this down. And they're going to take two stacks of wheat. And then we're just going to back away. And then basically once these guys are up there, I plan to pretty much strip down here um, and get them out, basically, and above ground. Because um, I don't need down here as much anymore, if, if I'm brutally honest. It was only a very temporary thing, so I didn't have to keep them there. And I kind of wish I never made them underground, because it's more of a faff than anything. Come on. Babbies, please. Because we need two newbie villagers to be able to put into our next two cells. And then we need to get a zombie up there, actually. So that... No, 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 no. Oh. Go away. Because uh, we need a zombie then to go in the middle. And that's like the final piece of the downstairs. Like, we need to take this block out, put a zombie in there. And then they should start producing iron golems for us to uh, to then drop down into the lava, so forth. Um, as far as I'm aware, that's pretty much it in terms of uh, doing things. So, hopefully they're, they're working on that down there. We need to clean our inventory up a little bit. Uh, let's just put this here for now. Uh, even if they're little babbies, we will just probably move them from babies because we just need to break the beds and have them claim the beds up there so they always sleep up there, which shouldn't be the worst thing. Um, oh, if they're making... Oh, I suppose it doesn't matter if the babies go through, though. Um, you guys done the thing? No, you haven't, have you? Could really do with you guys, you know. Making the babbies, if you know what I mean. What we'll do is we'll go get some more food. Maybe that's the issue. Um, more food. So what food can we give them? I think carrots and potatoes. Potatoes. Oh, chow. We're absolutely landing these these giant falls right now. Um, there's seven. Can we find any more potatoes? Let's see. One second. I don't think it's the easiest crop to come by. I'm actually, uh, talking of harvesting crops, I'm planning a new series. A new Minecraft series, don't worry. If, if Minecraft's your thing, I'm planning a new series with a friend. So I'm hoping that will be well received soon as well. Which will, I think it will require a lot of audience participation, hopefully. Is the, like, the grand scheme of things. If it works how I think it will. It'll get everyone nattering and stuff, which will be good. Um, let's just, more food for the people. That baby zombie has to be somewhere near here, because he's quite loud now. Alright, look at this guy, <laughs> having a great time in there. Uh, okay, we'll leave them to it once again. Is it because I hit that one guy by accident? I don't know. Where would that baby zombie be? He's like this way. Zombie groans. Let's see. If I go this way. Bat screeches. There's like a cave like. There'd be like a cave like right in here. Or something. Oh my god, there is. Look at that. Found it. I found you, buddy. Die. Stop making these noises under my base. Oh, I can hear more of them as well. I think this way. Oh my god, we're, we're like just using sonar right now. And he is definitely this away. Look at us go. Cleared out that noise problem 
quick and easy besides the spider hiss. We're not, we're not going for a spider hiss. Just the zombie was like, it's right, it was like floating right below the, the, um, the villagers. So it was just very annoying. Just mine all of this out real quick. Can't go wrong with a bit of coal. Right now I feel like it's one thing that I'm just lacking a lot of. Um, <laughs> always find myself sort of like needing to smelt something and then being like, oh yeah, can't do that. It's just, come on. Come on. Come on. Almost there. There we go. That'll do. I uh, just wanted to get rid of that. We can go check if a babby's been made. Maybe in the time it took us to do all of that, babby? Question mark? Babby? No, you guys are useless. I don't want to keep just force feeding you food, but we need two more villagers and then we need to wait for it to come night time so we can get, um, Zombert. And hopefully then we'll be all dandy. We may have to redo this depending on that zombie issue because basically what happens is if they need to see the zombie to be scared to generate these guys, these guys then need to come down. But if they don't get time to sleep in between... Another cat. Another cat. One that we don't have. One second. Um, if they don't get time to sleep in between they um they won't generate the big boys where did that cat go didn't go in with the didn't go in with the chickens cuz they'd be dead we never finished this island also i spent ages slowly and laboriously mapping out this entire island just to eventually go no I don't really care about finishing it oh there it is there, she, there it is she it um yeah, kitty, 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 kitty. as we look through the woods damn it Come on, there we go. Come on out. Quick. Out! Oh my god, you idiot. I've tamed you though, because you got stuck. You're mine. There we go. You required a lot of fish though, so you'll guard this, because clearly you're food oriented. We've tamed three varieties of cats so far. I don't know how many varieties there are. Um, oh, we've got more um, more potatoes to give, so we will go and give those in just a second. I just wanted to put this somewhere um, because we need them to have lots of food so they breed. I don't know if maybe they, they were in a food deficit so they're not breeding right now. <gasps> I heard a baby. Yes. More potatoes. And I need to find out, I can't take the baby yet because I need to find out which bed he's sleeping in. This could be it, this could be it. The second one that we need. I think it's because we were here. Um, oh, I'm just gonna go around the corner. So we need to find out what bed they're in so I can break their bed so that they set to the new bed. Because if they don't set to the new bed, we're just gonna have more issues in the long run. Because if they don't set, think they're sleeping up there, they'll never sleep which means we'll have the whole issue still. Oh, there's one. Two, beautiful, two babies. Okay, so we need to wait for night time now. We can then transport them both up and then we can pretty much get rid of this downstairs setup, which is good. Um, so we'll send those two up here. They'll come up, they'll go into their individual beds. Then all we need to do is get a zombie. Oh, there's, there's people banging their doors. All we need to get is a zombie. Um, then we need to move the other villagers over to there. Actually, while we're doing that, where are all the boats that I've made copious amounts of? Because we'll boat them over, probably. 
I have to have a load of boats somewhere. I made hundreds of boats at one point while I was doing the whole dragging. We don't have any boats. Madness. Um, we're going to boat them over and then literally just like down the waterfall that will be just here. Because this leads to like the front door area. Oh no. Okay. Yeah, we'll boat them over and just down there and then drop them down and then put beds somewhere inside so they'll go and sleep there and then it will be a bit more um, uh, organised. That's the word. So while this gets sorted, we're going to need some wood anyway to build those boats. Oh man, I need to get rid of some of this stuff. Like, that kelp is junk. Can we? We can, lovely. Kelp is just one of those things that, like, it's when it's in my inventory, it's just there. It serves literally no purpose other than being just there. Um, I think we can also mulch poisonous potatoes, right? Nope. Good to know. Uh... Chuck this in here for a second. I'm trying to clear my inventory so that it's not ridiculous. Uh, is everyone asleep downstairs? There's that. Oh, I need the the spare rails, don't I? Put them in here. But we need the spare rails so that... Is everyone asleep down here? No, 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 they're not. Why aren't you guys sleeping? Asleppy. Would you please a slippy? This is going to be a bit annoying if they're not asleep. So, what we need to do is, I think, break all of the beds. Because they may have um, unwittingly. This little guy is going to go to sleep. There we go, that guy is going to go to s Oh, Christ. There we go. Then we just need this guy to find that bed. Were they- what? They were both in the same bed, were they? Okay. Him in there. And then you. Okay, well, I'm not hugely fast if you don't claim the bed. I just need you to get over to the minecart and you'll have your own bed. You're going to really annoy me here. Kid. Damn it. Nope, not too far. Come on. Stop there. That's right. Fuck. This is a one big nudge. There we go. Nope. There we go. This way. Then, like this. Then, into the water. Then you come all the way up here. Go and find your bed. Yes. Bingo, bango, bongo. <gasps> oh no! Didn't think about it. Am I gonna come down there to dead villagers? <gasps> no, 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 no! Shit! Hello? 
baby went flying. Um, <laughs> that's fine. We just need to fix this hole. Fuck. We didn't think about that. Okay. Good to learn. We had spare materials, it's fine. This is what spare materials are for, right? Shit. Okay, wait. There we go. Okay. There's a baby now that is... Oh, damn it. There was nothing I could have done, I don't think. There's now a baby somewhere... Like here. There we go, okay. Let's just get you this way. Come on. We need to do this quickly, because we need to do this during the night. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, fair. He really came in clutch. You need to go into this waterfall here. Okay, yep. Yeah. Into here. Yep. Yeah. Come on. Did you grow up? Kind of? A little bit? Are you a bit bigger? Come on. In to the waterfall. In. In. Oh, this is going to be a real bitch, isn't it? Because as soon as you touch that, Come on. Okay, wait. Get onto the lip. Get onto the lip. Yes, okay. Then go down. No, no, go down. Oh, you're fair, actually. Yeah, yeah, go this way. This works. Yeah. Keep going, yeah, 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 yeah. That works. Did you go into bed? Sure. Which, oh, you went into that bed. Okay, that's fine, because you're a baby. You can scale. Okay, we just need to do this one more time with the other baby. I feel like we're definitely, like, cutting it fine with the hours in the day here. And you're still not... Who's who's woken up there? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, um... Come on! I think they're waking up! In! Yep, yeah, that's fine. Take him. Take him. Come on, yes. Go, 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 go. Mission Impossible. Into the bubble, later. Because I need you to claim the bed in time. I need you to claim the bed. Come on. Yes. Go and claim... The bed. Okay. Oh, yeah. Cause yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep these two at blocks. I don't really care. Okay. So that is all of the villagers now in. Oh, that was, to say the least, effort. Um, so now we can probably, I think, block this off. Because the zombie, we can take up the stairs. Yeah, it'll just be a bit slow. Um, and we can then carve this whole thing down.
There we go. Look at this. Efficiency. And then I just go down all the way. Oh, this was not efficient. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. There we go. Damn it. Okay, and this is where we want it to be. I mean, we've kind of fucked it a little bit, but that's fine. It's not the biggest deal. What we can do is we can just do that and it kind of works. Uh, we can then tear this down, this monstrosity. And then we need to get a zomba. And we need to get all those villagers out. But that's not the that's not the di most difficult part, to be fair. We go get the zombie, get name tagged, and then we're all done with this, basically. As far as I'm aware, I don't think there's anything else we would need to do. We just have to tear this down. Man, I'm learning though. I'm learning. I watched this video a couple times, but like, I'm trying to do a lot of it from memory. Because I should be able to do this stuff realistically by myself without um, the old YouTubes. Oh, we can actually see everyone though. If we go down another floor. Ooh, the babies are gonna be a problem. Didn't think about that. Okay. That might be something we have to solve in a bit. So we can't put the zombie yet in yet until we've taken care of that problem. Because if they... Um, if they grow up in the wrong spots. I need them to go back to their beds. Okay, we're gonna have to keep an eye on that then. Okay, well, what we should do is we have this place here where we can see them. Um, I just don't want them to grow up like idiots and suffocate to death. Because that will be a real bummer. Um, let's make little tactical incisions. Like here. And here. So that if they do grow up somewhere where it's going to be a bit problematic, they can get somewhere safe. Yeah, that seems reasonable. Okay. And let's just grab all of this real quick. Is there a... Yeah, there is a golem down there now. Um, and then we want to just move those guys around. Let's just put these in here for a second. Um, with then... We can put these back. Oh, actually, we can take all of those rails out now. Uh, yeah, I need to put that sign back, though. Done, there we go. How many villagers have we got down here? Just like FYI. We got one, two, three, four, five. And we got one, two, three, four, five beds. There we go. He was really struggling with the idea of getting into bed, wasn't he? And now he's got a bed. Uh, we just have to come out like this now. A bit weird, but that's fine. Um, so that's all back now. Oh my god. Why are people banging around? Stop banging around like idiots. Christ. There we go. We can put this back for now. We can put this back for now. Uh, we need to name this, to be fair. Uh, we shall call him Zomberto the Great. Zomberto the Great. There we go. Keep that safe. Then we're going to move the villagers that are down there. So that this becomes a bit more of a an easy way of doing things 
Okay, so we've got to go down there. I'm thinking boats float. Maybe I should test this first. This definitely seems like something that should be tested before put into practice. Um, if I go underwater to like the level that they're at, oh, that's going to be a little bit of an issue, but that's fine. If I put this down like here, uh, if I put this down like here, you can't put it down underwater. Okay, but if I like. I mean, they're not going to come out, are they? Yeah, because the water's pushing them away. Okay, cool. If I put this down, like... Like here. And I rode this, this way. Am I going to... Okay, wait one second. If I put this down, like here, and I rode this, this way... If I put this down like, oh well, we've got a test subject, and I rode this this way, are we going to sink, or are we going to float? Oh no, you need to go up for air, um, out, 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 oh my god, you're going to die my friend, you're not the most important villager, arguably none of them are, but, hooey, that was close. He is running straight back. Oh, shit. You didn't just go through here, did you? Hello? Did you? Oh, I put soul speed on my boots, by the way. Makes traversing this area a bit... Did he come through here? Did you see him? Did he go back through straight away? Wait. Get in here, you idiot. You bloody fool. Okay, so what I've learned basically is... Oh, come on. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Okay, right. This is one. We're just going to take them over one at a time. Clearly the idea that I initially had doesn't work. Um, Yahoo! There we go. Welcome to your new home. See you in a bit. <laughs> just abandon him down there. He looks incredibly lost. He won't climb up this, right? If he does, he's dumb. Okay, so there must be an easier way to do this, and I imagine it's using the already founded um, bloody... I thought we would have gone upwards, not directly just like kicked everyone out and gone, nope. Uh, I think we've just got to use this, basically. The bubble elevator that's already here. Uh, and just try and basically like pull them out. Come on guys. Off you come. Come on, you've got to be interested. See, this gentle... No. You're supposed to be... I'll take your jobs away. And I'll take your beds. <sighs> Nowhere left to go, boys, except out. Come on, eviction day. Time to leave. I'll flood you all. Oh, someone's still got their job. Lies. Come on, out we come. <sighs> Let's just slowly start boxing them off so that they have to come this way. Okay, 
slowly just start forcing them out one at a time come on out we go no 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 it's this way friends this away this away no no you are a rogue sir a rogue and you must leave this zone it's quarantined nope nope okay slowly but steady we need you to now no yeah that's that's it slowly but surely we're going to isolate them off until they feel like they've got no other choice but to go through the bubble elevator. Yeah, keep going, friends. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. Come on, there's only one way, and it's through water. Come on, people are talking outside my door. In Come on, this way, you bastards. Move. Mush. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. That's another block gone for you guys. You've got to get out. Go this way. Come on. Oh, we're seeing too many insides of heads. For any one man to cover. Yep. Gone. One of you's gone, haven't they? Where's he gone? <gasps> Did he go? Did he fall for the trap? No, no. He didn't. I don't think he did, at least. There's a bed above ground, people. Oh, come on. Get out. It's night time. Time to leave. Time to leave. Come on. Leaving time. Closing time. Do 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 do. Come on. Get out of this hole you're in. It's closing time. Time to get out and get out of this hole, you idiots. Come on. Yes. Come on. Almost. Oh, you turned around, you bastard. There's nothing for you here anymore. Life is upstairs. It's so good. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. Okay. Well, not fully. Almost. Come on. Come on, bastard. Come on. Come on, bastard. Almost. Yep. Yep. Okay. We're all in this room now, which is good. This is much closer to where we need to be going. We'll do this one at a time, you know. I, don't, I have time to kill. I have people to kill as well. This this episode's going long, isn't it? Okay, maybe we're going to call it here while I... That's fine for now. Do you know what? That's fine. That's progress. Right? No, it's not. Um, we're going to call it here. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. And I will see you in the next one.